happening today. These are my first public comments on the issue of gun violence, but I can promise you they will not be my last. Gun violence, no laughing matter for comedian Amy Schumer. There she is joining her cousin, Senator Chuck Schumer, today to talk about legislation to combat what she sees as a growing problem. So it was during a screening of Schumer's movie Trainwreck that a gunman opened fire in Louisiana last month. Seven's J.D. On Thompson is here now with more of Amy Schumer's message. Yeah, and after news broke of the movie theater shooting in Louisiana, Amy Schumer tweeted that her heart was broken. Now she is taking action hoping to stop something like that from ever happening again. A woman who has made a career out of making people laugh, taking a serious stance on gun violence. We're here today to say enough is enough, to mass shootings in our schools, our college campuses, our military bases, and even in our movie theaters. Less than two weeks after a deadly shooting during a screening of her movie train wreck in Louisiana, actress Amy Schumer joined her cousin, U.S. Senator Chuck Schumer, in the fight for tighter gun control. We need to talk about the solutions to gun violence and to fight hard to get the right folks on the right side of history. No one wants to live in a country where a felon, the mentally ill, or other dangerous people can get their hands on a gun with such ease. Two women were killed and nine people were injured before the gunman took his own life on July 23rd. My heart goes out to Jillian and Macy, to the survivors, to the families, and everyone who is tied to this tragic, senseless, and horrifying actions of this man who shouldn't have been able to put his hands on a gun in the first place. Now Schumer, who is known for holding nothing back when it comes to comedy, is vowing to do the same as she takes on gun control. The time is now for American people to rally for these changes. These are my first public comments on the issue of gun violence, but I can promise you they will not be my last. Hmm. The measure proposed by Senator Schumer would reward states that submit information to the federal background check system. States that don't comply would then be penalized. In the newsroom, Jody Thompson, 7 News.